Hey, orange one here. So we have a Mego tower and we're going to raid it because that is a really good way to get prisoners, but it's kind of dangerous. So we've got some really good gear to help us out here with our gas mask um, and assault rifle and some gear protection from that, you know, just in case we don't want to go deaf. And we can run in here, but this hot air right here will make you warm, so it's a good idea to do this at night. Now these Migos, they should see us and approach. Now I do have a flashlight here, it's a little bit low on charge, but it's enough to illuminate the area. These guys are coming towards us, shrieking. They're kind of annoying, but they're, they're also going to kind of attack like that. We do have some NPCs with us that we can use as bait a little bit. Um, these guys in my car, I've got like two dudes with me. But before we get them out, we'll just see if we can maybe even kill this one. Now, it's nice that we've got our plentiful ammo that we have here. Um, as you can see, that one's fleeing already. And we do have our buddy here. So this one's blind, apparently. I don't know. Maybe we shot in the eyes or something. It should go down. Pretty soon. Yeah, it's got heavy bleeding on it. So I'm pretty sure it's gonna die. And if it doesn't, it's fleeing. Let's stop running, because it's not a good idea to run with the gas mask. Now this, this other dude's going to run towards us. We can potentially get him to attack our NPC friend here instead of us with his ranged attack. Which is preferred, because they put pain on you. And if you can fight them out here, then you're not using up your gas mask. Um, filters, and you can actually conserve that more for the people that you're trying to save. And this is going like very well for us so far. I think that we'll just kill this one. Get nice aim on it. Yeah. Just um, take off the gas mask for a minute, get our breath back. got a fair amount of pain as it is. Back on. I'm actually going to try and move that corpse out of the way because it's going to be annoying there. Um, this dude that's with us, I'm going to keep you in the car. We do have um, our sledgehammer here which is going to be critical for getting through the resin cages. And in, in this day pack, I got a couple other back, uh, a couple other gas masks. But before we use that, we are going to. I believe there's there's zombies in here, so we could fight them, or not, kind of depending on how things go. These guys in here, we're gonna just get some bleeding on them, and you can even hear the NPCs right now up there, and we're in pain. Annoying. That one's gonna be hurting pretty soon. To the point where it's not gonna be a fight. Oh. Never mind. Move down. Nope. Um, oh, there's a zombie here. Okay. Walk. Just drop that for now. Okay. I can handle that. Oh, there's I have a skitterbot, a pet skitterbot with this, by the way. <laughs> um, so there is something to consider that um not where. Is it I've got this guy right here. Yeah. If you have a vehicle, you can have a vehicle cooler. Or vehicle mounted cooler, I should say. And then you can do this. Oh, hold on. There's a grabber. 
Um, turn on that cooler. We're gonna try and take care of this grabber though first, because my skater bot's probably gonna get hurt. If we don't. Oh, there's a couple of them. Oh, ow. Yeah, there's actually a couple zombies, so something to keep in mind is while you're um, attacking, there may be some other um, enemies that hear you. <laughs> Alright, um, I do have... Um, oh, nice, the Shambler's getting zapped. That means that we should be able to just kind of be mean. <laughs> Here, but oh, uh, they got hurt. Get the bodkin on this thing. Shocked the sham the shambler, and we did we did some damage too, right? There we go. Good job, Skittles. Dripping mechanical fluid. I'm gonna deactivate you. Your skills. Uh, it's just named Skitterbot now. It's not named Skittles. Aw. When you reset it, it no longer remembers who it was. I don't know. <laughs> We're going to cool down for a minute. Smart move here. Yeah, get indoors. Oh, he nice. He closed the door and skills is indoors with us. And so we're cooling down here. We can also just take a minute to um, get our morale back up. Which is probably not a bad idea. We do also probably have some aspirin around here. Yeah, let's just take a little aspirin. Take, take that pain down. Get our temperature down. Because if we can maintain a good temperature, that means that we can keep on raiding this tower fairly easily. The problem is if you get too hot. Um, or your gas mask runs out of charges. We're going to have our gun. We're going to see about those Migos. They might be right here. They're not. Cool. That gives us an Pretty good advantage actually. Now we are gonna be a little bit more in pain if they get their ranged attacks. So we're gonna see if we can get him to flee. Really? Okay. That one's tracking now. Really? Him. And now this guy is yeah, basically dead. That should be enough. So then we go up here and we should see uh, there's Amigo there, but we can't actually shoot him from where we're standing. Ah, okay, he's gonna get close. Auto. Did I do that? I don't remember going to auto. Actually, it worked out pretty nicely there. Did I... Oh, that dude over there seems to be hurt, maybe? Okay, there's another Amigo there. That's, that's what I thought. I thought there was usually one in here. If we take him out, we should be good to go. There we go, he's down. And that means that we're clear with these guys, and that me goes down. So we should be good, but look at our temperature, we're warm now. So 
so yay. I want to wield Masher. Yeah, put that in the sling. Yeah, that day pack, it's got some gas masks in there. But we need to recover just a little bit. And there's probably gonna be some zombies attacking as well. Let's get our, temp our temperatures already down. Our pain is, is pretty bad. <laughs> I might suggest that we just uh, breed for a minute. Just get that pain down. Now that these guys are not around, it seems like that might be worth it. It's kind of hard to say. Because, um, you know, enemies may be inbound. But I think that we're pretty safe. Can I reload that? Yes. Um, it's one of these guys. Cool. I think I'm going to go for it. I don't want to wait. So we're gonna run, do a masher, equip, um, can we turn on our flashlight just so we can see? Yeah, there we go. And run, 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 run. If we look here, we do have these other gas masks here. Oh, that's needed to be activated. That was kind of dumb to do here. I feared. Okay, um, we'll be back. Don't worry, guys. We'll be back. We did, we were too weak to smash the rebarb. Now, I've done it before, and it was like the first time each time worked. But as you can see, that's not the case here. You get your stamina back. Um, maybe in the car for your cool. Um, because we got our stamina, but we're still kind of in pain. Cool back down. Uh, stop running. Uh, where's the brainless zombie? You can see a brainless zombie there. Alright, um, we definitely don't want our day pack getting wrecked right now. Um, go. That brainless zombie, come here. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. See where our pain is causing us issues. I think we need to wait a little bit and then try Atlas again. So I might just wait, let that pain go down, and then you guys join back up with us. I think that we're good to try again. Run, 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 I think it's fine to run. There we go. We got one. Okay, so we finally got it in after quite a, quite a couple attempts. Um, we weren't quite strong enough, but we want this guy to come with us. So I'm going to talk to him, and then I'm going to actually... Um, Go to, what is it? Let's go to combat commands. Stick close to me no matter what. Um, and let's see. Miscellaneous rules. Let's do this. And let's get them up so that they don't investigate noises. That should be good. And if we do that, plus, um, I want you to do, you to use this item, let's get them to do that, and then they should come with this. What's his name? Harland. Hey Harland, you coming?
Let's go. It's coming. Okay, good. Um, I think this is the downstairs, and so if he's standing next to you and you go downstairs, I believe he will follow you. Yeah, there we go. We got Harland. He's coming with us. Now, I have had a bit of an issue with getting them to path out of here. This guy seemed to path out just fine and um, get into the vehicle totally dandy. Very happy with that, actually, how that went. Um, but I've had issues with the second and third one. So, um, can we talk about this armor? Can we remove that? Yes. Cool. So we came back in, we've got another dude, to Tommy Ruff, um, which we got, and they were not following me, and it was because their gas mask was not working, but now that they're wearing the proper gas mask, they totally will follow you out. And, um, yeah, you can totally get these guys out of here that way. Now, what you want to do is just give them something else to equip or like get them to let go of their items. So they have um, this armor on right here and he is also wielding something. So just get something in their hands and then um, go to sort armor and you should be able to unequip it. I think I had to reassign that for some reason um, and they should they should drop the proper gas mask. Um, so you're going to need something to give them to equip, just some sort of item, it really doesn't matter, and that should work. Um, and then this, what I've done is I've set up a little camp down here, um, which you can do um, by talking to any of your companions, um, going to what, do you, what can you do, um, you can talk to them about the camp, but if you want more information about exactly how to set up the camp they actually have all that kind of in these tutorials explained here um when they talk about faction camps so there's tons of stuff and in going into detail there i might make a whole separate video about that but one interesting useful thing that you can do here is tell these guys hey um, i want you to go to this camp that i've already set up um, and you can set them up very easily like hey build a camp here um, which I, I just did a little bit further down south um, and now that we have that one set, we can tell this guy, hey, go to that camp. And um, they should they should make their way down and they'll go join up the with the other group of NPCs. <laughs> um, nice, nicely, pretty nicely. Um, I think just kind of looking at our gas mask filter, we might want to reload that. Yeah, we've got another one in our backpack. So yeah, that's the basic premise of getting these guys out of here. Um, we do want to make sure we have Basher somewhere. It's somewhere around here. I think it's somewhere here. Right, give me a second now. I'll go find it, and then we should be able to um, proceed with our, yeah, freeing of people from here. We're just gonna wait um, with our little group of friends. You, my friend, can wait in in the vehicle. I don't know where you're going, but that that should be good as is. And I'm just gonna see if we can get one more. We might not be able to. The game might be like, nope, too bad. Oh, here we go. This one's free. We can talk to him. Come, come with me if you want to live. Um, and then D, I want you to use this item. Can we just give him, I grab like a smartphone or something. Yeah. I don't know if he's, no. Um, can we, Talk to you, um, D, I want you to do, uh, use this item, with good gas mask, uh, D, I want you to use this item, why don't you just wield said smartphone, okay, no, he's, he's, he's not going to do that, 
Um, so you need something bigger than his hands. But that person uh, should follow us. Miscellaneous. Um, let's go. Yeah, this dude. And then he comes right next to you. And you gotta wait. I'm, I'm waiting for a second to get him to stand next to me on that middle level. But same sort of deal as the other ones. He's come out here. Um, we do want him to unequip that. But the problem is, if you just try and get him to unequip um, what he's got there. Um, like if you go to sore armor here and you just do you, he's going to wield it. <laughs> Um, which is kind of annoying, but then you can, I believe, talk to him and possibly trade um, or get him to use a certain item if it's a better melee weapon um, than that. Thanks, I'll wield that now. Um, so he's wearing his mask, he's wielding the phone. Actually, that's actually perfect. Go back to sword armor, unequip. And then he'll drop that, and we can just grab that and tell him to go join the others. And you just rinse, repeat. Um, actually works out really, really nicely. So if we just do that, and then we say, what was it? Um, camp. Please go to this location. That camp that I've already set up. And he's off. He's even left the phone for us to reuse. That's awesome. He's just going off, dude, into freedom. Um, and, I mean, we are kind of hurt, but as you can see, our pain is going down right now, so we're kind of okay. I think that we could even try and do one more, possibly. And we can go from this cage... into that one. Oh, this person's trying to get out of here. Okay. That's fine. Um, B, E, gas mask, H, push you, you don't mind. Excuse the heartbeat. This dude's in a, in a rush. Get out of here. Cool. And yeah, we've got another person free of the Migo Tower. <laughs> um, talk. D. Or actually, no. It was R. Unequip that. And then talk. I want you to use that. And then he's wielding it again. R. Unequip. And we can just pick it up. Rinse, repeat. <laughs> Perfect, man. It's a really clean cycle. And then you can just send this dude to that camp as we did with the others. And, oh, wow. I, I'm, I'm liking this cycle quite a bit. We can get like all of them. But the problem is, is as we can see right here, is that now we've got a hostile that we got to deal with and a bunch of naked people that are unprotected. So, uh, yeah. With uh, great responsibility. Or great power comes great responsibility. Oh man, I messed that up bad. <laughs> Alright, this has been Orange One. Thank you for joining me. Hope you get yourself a nice little co-op going from your Mego Tower. <laughs>